Hello everyone. So let's discuss CPU scheduling. So first of all, you know, you know that CPU scheduling is uh, done or it is performed in ready to run state. Okay. So while discussing the scheduler, I already told you there are three types of scheduler. One is long term scheduler, which will be performed in which will be performed from uh, new to ready state and there is short term scheduler which will be used from ready to run state so cpu scheduling or cpu scheduler mainly used in ready to run state or run to ready state okay and who will uh, perform this cpu scheduling so the question is who will perform this cpu scheduling short term scheduler short term scheduler short term scheduler is abbreviated as sts and you know that short term scheduler is responsible for context switching it is responsible for context switching okay so who will perform short term scheduler where it will perform from ready to run or run to ready state okay now there are various cpu scheduling algorithms used there are various cpu scheduling algorithms used which will decide which process uh, to be picked by cpu and which process to be not picked by cpu so we will see all such algorithms and decide which uh, cpu scheduling algorithm will get better performance and better efficiency coming to the context switching okay so in the next video we will start various cpu scheduling algorithms